I'm Bernard Lacks. I'm the Chief Executive Officer and Pulp Studios was founded 23 years ago and I've been the, been the founder since. This business is primarily making specialty and decorative glass where many other glass companies are make, making primarily just monolithic types of products that are used in standard commercial storefronts or in buildings. Our product always has something unique about it. Um, initially we moved, we had three different facilities. Um, Gardena had the right placement for us in terms of uh, where we wanted to be in Southern California. It was easily accessible to the different freeways we access and um, we were thankful enough that we found space available here at the time we needed it. The business has grown very organically. I mean, we, we're a specialty company, we do a very special product, but um, the move to Gardena has allowed us actually to grow even more and become more efficient. When we had multiple facilities, it was difficult for us to move uh, materials around from location to location. Now they're all in one place um, and we have a, 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 an environment in the city that's a little bit more friendly than it was in LA. Um, it's allowed us to expand and do it with, uh, with the speed that we needed to to keep the business running while we did the move. Um, I like the small city kind of atmosphere, having um, access to the city officials, being able to talk to them about our plans, the things that we needed to do in the facility and, and their cooperation and supporting that is something that for a business owner is always something that makes it much simpler and easier for us to kind of get the things accomplished that we need to accomplish in a short period of time. I mean, we're not going anywhere. This is a pretty large facility. Um, the cost to move it here, the cost to build the infrastructure here um, was something that was very, very significant. So we're not really planning to go anywhere. Um, we'd like to possibly purchase more uh, land and real estate in Gardena over the future. And as we grow, um, be located here. It's, uh, it's just an easy access point for us and um, it's close to the airport and it's close to the port, which are both things that we utilize every week. Well, when I first came to Gardena, the first thing I did was meet the city staff before we even started on the project. So I would say that being proactive with the city staff was a key to making everything run smoothly when we came to Gardena. And uh, the staff, the economic development people, the city manager, um, the police chief, all those people have are people who we've worked with and who have made it much simpler for us to come to the city. And when we need something, they're always accessible to try and help us. And that's, I think, key to having any business anywhere is the access to the staff. My, my advice to anybody who uh, wants to come to the city of Gardena would, would be the same path that I followed, which is be proactive with the city, let them know who you are, let them know what your needs are as you come into the city in terms of infrastructure and power. Um, they have great resources that they'll introduce you to and um, being proactive allows you the ability to have allies and, and people who can assist you along the way rather than fighting a battle which is always difficult. Um, it's going to be a place where in the future uh, that a lot of people are going to want to relocate to and probably there won't be the space in commercial uh, property um, or industrial property by the time that comes along. So live and work in Gardena.